All right. So we are back. It's the world's most smoked out podcast. We love hip hop. I'm your host with the most toast, Friday Ricky Dread, aka um. Ah, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Um, glasses, Stallone. Oh, the, 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 the Patakis? <laughs> the Patakis? Well, the Patakis, um, a.k.a. Mr. Pataki, a.k.a. Um, um, Morphia. And to the left of me. It's me, SSC underscore Hayherx underscore PK See on Instagram, as usual. Yeah. Smokey yeah. Bear, Paul Bunyan, you done know. You done know. Hold yeah. it down. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we're back. You know, it's the regular Thursday morning activities. You know what I'm saying? Season four, 121. One, yeah, 121. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're getting up in numbers now. You know what I'm saying? We're one of them senior podcasts now. You know what I'm saying? And I'm old school podcast. You know, you're not, the not elder the, statesman. The elder statesman's not the Johnny come lately. You know what I mean? But yeah, we're, we're, we're back again. It's the regular Thursday morning activities. Um, big shout outs to this Youngster Damn Lounge over here at 529 Young Street, corner of Wellesley. Um, Una oh. momento. On my phone this time. Yeah. Yeah. Hello? Oh. Yo. Yeah. Disconnection. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, uh, so I was, so I was there with the tray. Okay. Scene. But yeah, big up Thank to you. the Amsterdam Lounge over here, 529 Young Street, corner of Wellesley. Um, it's going to be reopening soon, but for now, you can get, you know, book them for events, anything like that, private private events, stuff like that. Uh, if you want to hit them up, hit them up on Instagram at Youngsterdam underscore lounge. And I meant to say Youngsterdam event space, not Youngsterdam lounge. Oh, so, Youngsterdam. Event space. Um, also, big up to all the people who are watching on YouTube right now. Make sure to please subscribe, um, leave your comments, leave your likes. Um, big up to the whole comment gang, comment gang scrow. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You got any uh, shout outs before we start the show? Um, no, I'll get the shout outs later. Oh, RIP. Yes, RIP John Singleton. Yes, yes, RIP John Sorry, Singleton. Sorry, but I know that's what you were going to say, so yeah. No, no, that wasn't what I was getting at, oh. but that, I see it on the, on our page here, and how could I forget? Um, I never, I got to listen to him talk in mm. February of 2013. He was here for, like, some TIFF mm. event. And, yeah, he was there, and he was being questioned. And he's answering questions, you know? It's one of those, like, sitting and listening whatever yeah it was very good because i say one thing i know he's real niggerish i know he's a black <laughs> guy but like yo the way he was talking real niggerish you know talking that real talk real shit like yo well he know? was one of the youngest directors ever to like um be a nominated for academy academy award he was a not he was nominated at 22 or something like that wow don't quote me exactly but it was like around that range 22 24 for mid 20s yeah yeah for like boys in the hood okay you know what in honor of uh, John Singleton, let's go through a little bit of some of the movies that he's done. What's one of your favorite John Singleton movies? Obviously, Boys in the Hood. Boys in the Hood. Baby Boy. Oh, Yo, you see, you see, Baby Boy. The best thing about Baby Boy is the scene in the park. Mm. He's like, oh. This little nigga got heart. I ain't gonna punch you in the face, little nigga. But I'm gonna beat you like your daddy, nigga. Yo, man. And the man takes his belt off and starts whooping the nigga. And yo, to me, that's the funniest shit in the whole movie. You know yo. what I'm saying? But yeah, that yo, there's so many, but... <coughs> four Brothers? I, I, I was in Four Brothers. Mm-hmm. Bop, bop, bop. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, Extra mm-hmm. in Four Brothers, you know? To be honest, I've never seen that movie personally. So, you know, y'all can kill me now for that, but... Um, it. Yeah, yeah. Watch it. watch it. It's a classic, apparently. Just watch it. Yeah, yeah I got to talk to. I yeah. got to speak to Andre Three Thousand that day, and I asked him about the purple, the purple gun in the in the the Desert Eagle. That's like that nice, like metallic. He's like, yeah, it's a real thing, but it doesn't work no more because it got dipped. Uh. So I'm like, oh, that shit is fucking fire. Back in the day, I'm like, yo, what is that? Yo, that's a crazy thing. Big gutsy Desert Eagle, but. Anyway. Yeah, I remember that. I remember seeing that in the trailer. And I was like, "Yo, that's a sick that's an eagle." No, but in his, this is on his album cover. This was oh, on the album cover. The love below. Yeah, and it was like like a pink, anodized almost type of. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I yeah, asked yeah. him about that, and he's like, "Cause we got like 
it was in cross or whatever. And mm-hmm. I asked him real quick, and he's like, "Yeah, it was real, but it doesn't fire anymore." Mm. But yeah, man. Um, so, you say "Boys in the Hood" is your favorite, or "Baby Boy"? Well, if you were to choose, if you had to, I would choose have to one. go with "Baby." I would have to go. Sorry, I have to go with "Boys in the Hood." Simple fact because when I went, when I got to go see "Boys in the Hood." It's my mom that actually took me to go see Boys in the Hood, so that's a really good memory for me. Mm-hmm, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? So I would have to say Boys in the Hood. Savvy, bring that mic over to you. Um, the Ghost in the Room want to talk room. tonight. Talk to ready. What's your favorite John Singleton movie? Um, the one that I remember the most, because mm-hmm. I couldn't say I can't say that I have a favorite, but the one that I remember the most would also be Boys in the Hood. Boys in the Hood. Mm-hmm. Gucci. Yo, it has to be. Did he make Menace? No, no he, that's the no, Hughes. That's the Hughes Brothers. That's a great movie, though. Okay. Also a dope movie, though. That movie's fire. Poetic Justice. Poetic like, Justice with Pop. Okay, it has to be Boys in the Hood. It has to yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's yeah. not Menace. Boys in the Hood all around. He said it's not. He didn't make Menace then? Okay, Boys in the Hood. All right. <laughs> no, no, Boys in the Hood all around for, for all of the whole room. Because even me, myself, when I first started, when I first seen that and Menace to Society, it was like. Yo, this is what LA is like? Society is fire. What? Yeah, that Menace was crazy still. So. Fire. It was like a first time look, besides NWA records and, you know, the videos and stuff that I used to see back when I was a kid, those are like glimpses. But like to watch like a, like we left a move that, those are like on, and you know, my bad, because I'm trying to like minimize the amount of the use of this word. Nigga night, nigga Tuesdays, <laughs> right? Yo, he did higher learning too, right? I think so. Yeah, he did. He did do, do higher learning. You know what I'm saying? Cause so, higher learning. I remember that movie also. We the, you don't know higher learning? I I watched it. I watched it. Yo, we went. It's just. Yeah, I'm it's pretty not sure if it's John Sing, if it's him, if it's that's his movie there, that's another movie I'd have to say because, yo, I have another memory of that, and that was with. The Parkdale, uh, Missouri Community Center in Parkdale. Mm. All of the whole, like the whole man from the community center, we all mm. went like 30 deep to go watch fucking higher learning. Higher learning. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, like, <laughs> yo. John Singleton, you are absolutely correct. All right. Mm-hmm. So, yo, we went to see that. Like, yo, man, like, shout out PZ. You know who you are. Big mm. man OG in Parkdale. Shout out PZ. You understand what I'm saying? Man like PZ and certain other older staff mm. came with us to the theater. And we, it was a, it was a literally like, yo, it was like the whole center. It was, it was an like event. A, 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 It was after a ball night, Tuesday night. It's like, yo, let's go watch this higher learning movie. Yeah. We jumped on the streetcar and we went to the theater like 30 deep. You understand what I'm saying? And But back them times when there was a movie going on, especially like a movie where like, you know, there was enough black people. Not every movie black movies let's grab one this yeah we'll grab one there grab it too. <laughs> aka grab them on I, oh pause actually no aka grab them on <laughs> I'll oh, take that one back the common gangs on you now right I'll, I'll, I'll take that one slick. back you know what I'm saying <coughs> oh, but yeah um, my chest Ooh. the grab a kid you know the grab a kick me in my chest that's all that's a little switch yeah, up to you empty uh, that Yo, in there or I just... take it all the way back why what's going what, on what do you got from the beginning <laughs> Poetic Justice is the movie. You mentioned Poetic Justice. Yeah, but that is my movie. I, I take just it said back. Poetic I Justice. I take mine back. Oh, I keep Tupac. Yo, she, she, I didn't hear any of that. She, 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 she said, oh shit, Janet Jackson with the Not box braids with Tupac. That shit was Tupac. Ooh. That man got his head blown off. True. Right no, you know, you wanna, the movie. Okay, Sorry. so you know, a, a, a tidbit. Uh, uh, Q, um, Q, no, Tupac. No. No, what? Q-tip was in that movie too. Q-tip, it's right in the beginning of the movie. Well, I just the, right in the beginning, they're mm-hmm. at the mm-hmm. drive-in. So he gets his wig blown. And bow, you get blo- right oh, in yeah. your head. So he's like you the black that, guy in the world. That's how movie. it starts. John Singleton <laughs> said that uh, Baby Boy was actually written for Tupac. Yes. Oh. Yeah. It was yeah, actually yeah. written for Tupac. Tyree's but Tupac, chocolate ass played a good, <laughs> good part in that. Tupac, <laughs> Tupac told him, well, he did, he, I don't think he said he was ready for it or whatever, or he was doing other, other obligations. Yeah. And, and, and he just went with Therese. And the rest is history. Well, you know, Jody, John Singleton has definitely made an impact on the hip hop community as well as the, the whole mu- movie world. You know what I'm saying? But on a side note, mm. the man died because of high blood pressure. That's what caused his stroke. Yes. So, 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 black people, you know, we love to eat with greasy foods we and love our, that you know, shit. oxtails and extra gravies and mm-hmm. stewed mm-hmm. chickens and, and fried and jerk chicken and everything. You know. Go get yourself tested for that blood pressure because 
That's what gave the man the severe stroke that ended up killing him. The sugar, your sugar, my sugar. No, it's not. It's not your sugar. It's not the same. I just salt. But that's what people call it. No, the old sugar is diabetes, fam. Yo, listen to me. Salt and sugar. (laughs) Salt and sugar are the two main killers, eh? Yes, they are. They're the two main killers. Mm -hmm. Salt and sugar. Those will kill you faster than any drug you do, you know. Mm -hmm. Salt and sugar. Stop. Just change your oil, okay? Vegetable oil. Switch your oil. It'll eat more help. vegetables too, yeah. please. Eat it more greens, help. you know, eat more vegetables, but also get yourself checked out. Yeah. Don't be scared. Yeah, and let, 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 find out about your blood pressure because man was 51 years old, okay? That's Yo, young. Bro, that's a that's a pup. That's a puppy mm-hmm. age though, 51. Tracks. Like, yo. Okay, my older I have, sister's older than that. I, I, yeah. I, like, like, I'm not that old. My, my, thank God, my, 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 my sister just turned 50. My I'm dad sure. just turned 75. Mm. You understand what I'm saying? My next sister, she's, her birthday is coming up. My mom Two of my sisters. You understand? Two yeah. of my sisters. My mom, her birthday is coming up. Like, yeah. yo. So I, I give thanks. But please, yo, check out your guy. Make sure you guys check yourself out, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because so maybe he could have caught that if he knew, you know? Yeah, well, originally what happened, he caught a severe stroke. He was rushed to hospital. And then, then afterwards, they put him in a coma. It, he went into a coma. His family said that he died peacefully. So yeah, they took him God. out for life support or yeah. whatever to see what if he would breathe on his own. And then yeah, he so passed. R.I.P. To, to to John Singleton, definitely a great one. You know what I'm saying? For sure. There's still 35 million of his estate that needs to be um, that is un, unclaimed. Oh wow! Um, well, yeah. now the vultures are gonna start coming. Yep. Well, Here I think he had a will. He had a will. Yeah, and there's still 30. There's 35 million that's left. Um, that's left un, un, un unspoken for. unspoken for his yeah. his mom has the will so she's really, yeah. already done all of that she's been through it and that's what that's what's going on right now interesting what's the word is it probate or no is that what it is or do you um, will no mandate probate yeah. uh, probate i don't know but executive yeah, executive of the will or whatever beneficiary beneficiaries beneficiary. those are the people that receive the money the, yeah. the person that gives it out, you know, power attorney. Yeah, power attorney or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His mom has it. I hope, yeah, she's gonna do it right, and I hope that extra thirty-five million goes to where it belongs. Yeah, yeah, and you know, probably there's gonna be some foundations that get help from that as well, and things like that. Because I'm sure he had his hands in different things <laughs> that were were helping the community. It's a well, loss, you know definitely. Saying? Yeah, we don't know what movies he was coming with next. Oh, for sure. There's a there's a TV series that he started that is still continuing now that is going to be going into his next season. I don't know the name, but you know it'll be in the tight in the credits and whatever or common gang y'all know what it is you know what i'm saying snowfall snowfall thank you savvy um let's get to our top six though. oh that's what the la with the mm-hmm, mm-hmm, oh mm-hmm. that show is fire too man mm. you 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 be on you be watching tvs and shows and stuff i be right? watching i watch snowfall you, you watch that yeah with franklin okay the aka freeway ricky young freeway ricky mm. and the cia mm. inf- is flooding california with the drugs you know, they just in season. You can't be talking the season. Why not? Nobody it's season, it's season. Season. Alert, by Yo, way, people. I'm giving you a quick, <laughs> you a quick, quick breakdown. Now, fam, just say it's about drugs and in LA, All fans right. are gonna watch it. Just no say, <laughs> it's about Freeway Ricky. Freeway Ricky and Ricky and, and, and and the CIA. And, uh, Norton what was that his name? The real Rick Ross. No, just the the other Rick Ross, the one. Oh, Rose. Like no, just the Rose, but the real Rick Ross. You know what I'm saying? Um, who wants this? Savvy, you want this? <laughs> but let's get to our top six tracks in Toronto. You know what I'm saying? Um, tracks that have been compiled of, of, of since. What's the date today? Let's what's the date see. today? Be good. Find the date today. It's the first today or the second. The second yeah. while people are hearing this. So any tracks between last week and, and the last seven days is what you're going to be hearing in the top six. Chosen by the people, originally from the top ten videos. You know what I'm saying? There's been a lot of tracks that have dropped, but most oh, of them some Toronto ambiance in the background. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Michael. The, the 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 Toronto sound system. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'll let that pass for a quick second. Um, but yeah, compiled of tracks that have been, you know, in the top ten list, and there's been a few more tracks that have dropped since the list has dropped. So they'll be in the honorable mentions. Scene. So number six. Bimo and Gordo Brazy and Lil Six, honest. What I've seen, young and so G, if you know what I mean. I pray for my mom, but she's praying for me. I'm trying to save my sis, but she's trying to save me. Can't save that nigga when we jump out. Sing. 
So that's that gully gully shit right there. Man, them are all representing on the track. Very lovely. Um, there's ski masks. Ski masks are in the video. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, them are doing uh, yo, Ski Mask Rick, you didn't you, you didn't know about you my drink? You made him a meme? Yeah, Listen, it was yo, awful. That's just my regular. You know what I'm saying? But big up to the man, them. Big, big, big tune. Scene. I'm back to big tune this week. Yay. It's not barred. Whatever. Hey. Mm-hmm. Next on our list, though. Number five. Cheetah on road. Back on the road, we collecting the door. Scene. All y'all niggas are like not in the know today, y'all are y'all are not <laughs> in the know this week of the of the tunage. But you know what is good about this list? It's a lot of the up and coming artists that have been doing their thing on the scene. Um Big up the Cheetah. Quick side note, not side note. Over the years that we've been doing this show, we've seen a lot of artists gain a lot of notoriety. Some go down, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of new rappers come into the scene, eh? So There's a lot of rappers in this city. Oh, yeah. Like, for example, this Cheetah guy right here, he's got mad numbers on his video right now, you know what I'm saying? So he's, he's building a fan base right now and bubbling, you know what I'm saying? So, big things. That's good. Um, next on our list, though. Boovy Lessons. Okay. <laughs> I'm looking at Sav's face, but I'm not even gonna say nothing. You already said it I though. Said it. <laughs> like, yeah, we were talking about that. I was talking about that. You know, Brian just what? keeps throwing me under the bus oh, every week. Yeah, if I man. if I don't say nothing, I something. If he says something, <laughs> yeah. I something. Yeah, <laughs> boop, 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 boop. That's the bus. <laughs> backing up over Sav, parking, ready in front of her to back over her. Oh, but yo, big up to Doobie. Big, big tune. Um, that's on Instagram. That's Doobie or 17 Doobie. Is that V for Victor or B for Bravo? V for Victor. Thank you. Thank you so much. I, I, I kind of like got it like a little bit of a slur lisp, I guess. So it's like, <laughs> I don't know like, what like a V or a B. Yo, know on a side note, that has nothing to do with music or anything here. Mm-hmm. I made some brownies the other day. And yo, <laughs> they've been kicking my ass ever since. <laughs> You see the edible so story? Yeah. Oh, bro. And man didn't bring out no brick and brownies. Come on, fam. My oh, bad. Yeah. I apologize. How you know you didn't hear the man said it's looking him it's, still. It's, it's, yeah, it's 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 I'm looking at your face. Yeah, like, I was like, I grin. see the grin. And it's true because uh, when I open the door, it's the same thing. Right I'm telling you, it's like I just feel it still in my system. Holy, this guy's got a body buzz, dude. I just smoke and it just comes back. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. But yeah, yo, 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 you downstairs? Okay, hold on, hold on a second. I'm gonna send somebody down. Yo, all right. Yo, somebody's at the door. Um, okay, let's get back to the list here. Okay, so number three, and yo, big up to Doobie, big big two, same. Number three, thoroughbred, a vibe. Yeah, big up to um, Flash Johnson, um, Movies Only. He's the one who directed that video right there, the the UK guy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, London to Canada too. Okay. Yeah, man. Video is crazy. And Thoroughbred is a fucking beast on the lyrics, yo. It's dope rapper. Mm-hmm. He ain't playing, yo. He's not playing. You know what I'm saying? Um, number two, though. We Love Hip Hop Alumni. Twy. Featuring Gulila, fake news. You, telling you to do things she would never do, like leave your man and find something new. Pull yourself a Russell so when the end you lose. I'm for the. Yo, big up Twy. He, he's been kind of low for a minute. You know yeah, he came back with a vengeance. Yeah, 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 yeah. Big, 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 big tune and and friggin'. Yo, my track from it is Ten Toes Down. Mm. I, 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 First she was square when she came in, now she's ten toes down. Yo, bro, listen to me. 
Holy, but yeah, man, big up to Twy902, big up to the whole live gang. Dope, live dope gang, interview. shark gang. Shark gang, that's that's the next squad, that's the... They're saying, yeah, they're fam. Mm. And the girl, Gulila, she does her fucking thing on the tune right there. Big up to her, big up to her. Um, Number one. And I'll give y'all a quick little sound effect for number one here. Whoa, careful, sir. <laughs> number one, bully magicians. No, no, I got a problem with expressing all my feelings. And you will never catch me walking, holding hands with no holes. I got a problem, then I'm calling my... Ah. Scene. Big up to bully. Big, big tune. That's the tune there where he's like, um, if anything, the knockers come with my magicians. And then they just show the man's in the white mask. So I'm like, <laughs> holy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Magic, make you think it's a peer. Yeah, I was just like, yo, it was one of those ones when I seen, when I seen that hook come in for the first time, I was just like, say less, fam. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He, he flipped that one very sick. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm feeling that track right there. So big up, big up, big up to Bully right there. Um, quick set of honorable mentions. Hey, how y'all doing? Don't forget to like and leave your comments below. And if you like videos like this, as well as others on our channel, please remember to subscribe to the channel as well as hit the notification bell so you'll know when we're dropping new videos daily.